this again, F10 to get live, F9 to stop my logging. There we go, F9. Let's try our pull again. Now it shut off. Let's see why it shut off. We can see it made uh, 343 horsepower, 268 torque. So it's obviously making a bunch of power. Switching to the high cam. Let's jump in here. I have a feeling the lean protection actually kicked on here. And that's what caused it to have this problem. Let's jump in. Let's take a look here. Uh, no, it actually wasn't the lean protection. It was actually boost cut. So let's look at this and talk about it. Um, up top here on the table, about 6,800. We're hitting about 14.9 uh, PSI. And if we're panning through here, this is right about the point where it cut off in the log. And I don't see... There we go. Boost cut actually turned on. We can see that it illuminates here. This little uh, checksum or the, the little Boolean logic on the side here shows me that the boost cut went on. Now, I programmed jumping in here. Let's go ahead and close this. Let's jump into parameters. Jumping into boost cut. We programmed it at 15. So we eclipsed 15 PSI boost and it shut it down. So I'm okay with raising it right now because I know I'm going to go higher than that. So let me go in here, set this all to 20 PSI. I'm going to go a little bit higher and let's jump back in here again. And take a look at this. Now our duty cycle and our injectors, we're going to about 70% here. Let's look at our spark timing real quick. We're about five degrees ignition timing. We're super conservative on ignition timing. I'm gonna be expecting probably going at least five to eight degrees higher than that at this at the same boost level. And we're probably gonna be noticing that the boost doesn't creep as much um, as we were. I was kind of talking about the low cam. Didn't seem like it had a whole lot of effect. Um, on the high cam, it definitely makes a huge difference by adding spark timing. So we might not be going up to 14. We might only hold about 11 or 12. Um, we're going to be seeing what happens when we get to that point, but we just need to concentrate on our fuel tuning alone right now. Uh, let's jump into our table here. Let's look at our overlay, and let's see this here. So 